welcome back to my is the mains channel period poo hey guys welcome back to my channel my channel mainly consists of vlogs pranks challenges and business talk um so this is my third video of the year which i'm crap me because i'm trying to be consistent right i'm trying to be very consistent um please do me a favor and go ahead and follow me on my business page at my underscore essential on instagram i sell wholesale main clashes 3d i sell main clashes an affordable price um please go ahead and follow my personal instagram page which is shamaya underscore nelson if link will be in the description below if you're interested overall right so in this video i'll be talking about ways in which you can stay motivated as an entrepreneur to be honest i've had days where i feel like i like i just lack motivation in my business in regards to my essentials i've had days where i constantly be paying putting in the work but no sales and to be honest the only it, the, I realize that the times when I lack motivation is when I'm not getting any sales and that kind of sucks because sales should not determine whether or not I'm motivated it's, it's like I'm motivated by money but I kind of am I am I am kind of motivated by money like who isn't but at the same time my motivation shouldn't solely depend be dependent on me making money if that makes sense so yes um lo losing motivation is inevitable like you cannot avoid it it's going to come one way or another but the key is when it comes to having a business and when you feel like you just can't do this anymore the key is to just not to give up it is to just stay motivated and in this video i'll be sharing some tips that has helped me tremendously and ways for me to, you know it's a process and every day is not the same but these tips are very helpful and here here are the tips if you're in the first key when it comes to staying motivated while being an entrepreneur and probably you are working a nine-to-five so i've been a nine-to-five and working an entrepreneur it is sometimes tiring right and losing and by you losing interest is inevitable it's going to come one way or another right okay so key number one is create personal goals for yourself um, when you first started your business you probably created goals in your mind for your business like reasons why you even start your business for me personally when I initially thought about starting a business was because um, I just wanted to invest my money or and to flip my money and also to make more money <laughs> and also to make more money and what I was earning and my regular nine-to-five if you watch that video then you'll know what I'm talking about so those were my like one of the reasons why I start because of more money I wanted money right so as you start your own business you with everything that's going on you would usually forget the reasons why you started and the goals you had in mind for why you started so what i suggest you do is to jot down your goal it's either short term or long term goals for what you want for yourself and for your business by doing so you can always revisit back those goals to remind yourself why you even started in the first place some reasons to become an entrepreneur is reason number one you want to become your own boss and who does not want to do that yes being your own boss is sometimes draining and it takes a lot don't think it's it's minky minky work no it takes a lot a lot of sleepless nights a lot of um, money a lot of it takes a lot second you want to create your own products um, thirdly you want the opportunity to grow and watch your business flourish and grow and most importantly it's either you want to have a business or something that you're passionate about yeah and the other one is that you want to choose your salary and be not because not because you have your own business that does not mean that you should not pay yourself you should always pay yourself remember that remember me tell you that that is one thing that i've yet to do which i am starting to do i started to do 
pay yourself pay yourself first and whatever money is left you use it to reinvest in your business save that save some but always remember to pay yourself first right because you're putting in all this work what do you get from it you get me so pay yourself key number two is leverage triumphant entrepreneurial stories which basically mean listen to listen to um inspirational motivational stories things that may uplift your spirit when you're feeling down and lack motivation this is something that i personally do i will for example if i if i want to set the tone for my day i would listen to inspirational stuff on youtube they are free i would listen to books they are free on youtube i would watch other successful business men and women documentaries and see where they are coming from just so me cannot so just so that i don't feel like it's me alone here like I'm only going through this because it's me like everybody go through this phase and everybody goes through downfall and discouragement and they lack motivation in their business especially when it's not going according to all they want it so one of the things that you can always do is listen to other people success stories you can learn a lot from me and most importantly you can learn from them and it's all on your phone it is for free it's free no <laughs> it's like wow but did i say that i read books i don't read books sometimes we read the books if i have them available at home but sometimes we'll listen to them so whether they are 10 hours long on youtube or five hours long on youtube i i will listen to them whenever i get the time to and trust me they are so beneficial so informative like me learned so much from just one book uh, two books i can recommend at the moment is rich dad poor dad i've listened to that whole entire book i think it was six hours long you know me listen to it over a period of time um next one is richest man in babylon when i finished that one yes i finished that one and now i am on what's that one name now I am on another one but I can't remember the name because I've only started listening to it like two days ago but it is good so far those books are really informative like you need to listen to them but they're broji you, you need to listen to them but they trust me if I don't feel motivated if I lack motivation this is my routine let me tell you my routine first my man can attest to this first I would probably just look like this like my face will just look sulky and I will be thinking of ways to better off myself then I will go into the mindset of this happens to everyone not just me and it's it's up to me to lift myself up because who else is going to lift myself up I'm going to be here like this for a good while right so I have to lift myself up then I will probably go watch a movie then or watch a documentary or listen to a book or listen to one of those motivational speeches on youtube and get my mindset you know and sometimes i'll even look back on my sales and my customers and the persons that i've helped along my journey in my business and that do give me the um the motivation that i need sometimes when i think about the many people that have reached out back to me and telling me how much money they've made and how much how much they love my products and all those good feelings and good times that I had before lacking motivation I would reminisce on those and that put motivation in myself to continue and don't stop as long as me not give up i can i can think about it and reminisce it and be stagnant for a day or two but not for a week or so no no it's up to me to get myself back up right and it's up to you to get yourself back up and do what you have to do and get your business running and get your life running so you have to, you have to motivate yourself boom 
I know my mother talking, so I've seen me like my mother gibberish. And as you know, I've been a chat gibberish from a long time. So, if you're new here, are you new here? Oh, you're new here. <laughs> if you don't get that, that's a TikTok joke. <laughs> Next one is engage in motivational activities, go to church, which is what I've been doing recently, and it's amazing, like, it's amazing though. I went to Crusade for three nights straight. I have not been to church in years, about three, three years, and let me tell you, me, by me being in Crusade, sitting in church, listening to what and taking in God's words and to what the pastor had to say it's like I just felt so at peace it was a great feeling we can't even express how I felt at the time but it was a great feeling and I want that is how I want to feel for the rest of my life while I was there I was not anxious about anything I was just there I was so attentive. I was I was listening. Like me, I took in everything. My, 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 my mind just upon my, my eyes was just on the past. And just I take in words and I said, Jesus Christ. Wow, that is so true. True. Like I'm in something I'm, in, I'm like, wow. It was a good feeling, bro. So do stuff like that. What you can visit the beach, which I love to do. I love to go to the beach and just I don't have to swim. I just go to the beach I'ma just lay down on a you know I'm a local blanket if me carry a blanket and a chair or whatever and just watch the waves or you know, I'm just there laying down and in that moment at that time I am not thinking about anything I am just watching the waves go by so whenever I feel stressed or anxious that is one of the things that I like like that I love to do is go to the beach and just watch the waves are just the ambience itself I'm, I'm, I'm a simple girl you know I'm a simple girl bro I also love to listen to gospel music like that just put me now in good mood too you know if I just every morning me get up and just listen to some gospel some Tasha Cubs a Cubs or Coombs or whatever she name I just love listening to some gospel every morning like that put me in a good mood to start off my day like it just start off my day right and I just feel motivated I feel like I can do anything anything with God yeah hallelujah another way to stay motivated is we worry yourself we worry yourself Sometimes I do reward myself by getting myself stuff that I've, I've seen and wanted but decide not to get because a girl gotta stick to her budget, right? Just give yourself incentives, reward yourself because by you doing so, you're going to always want to do stuff that you can reward yourself for, right? If you reach a milestone, reward yourself. If you if you accomplish certain amount of sales within the time period that you give yourself, reward yourself for it. Reward yourself for the minor stuff because those are stuff that makes you feel like you are doing something and makes you feel like this is all worth it, right? So do that. So treat yourself, boo. Treat yourself. Yes, you are a boss, babe. And yes, it can be stressful. It is stressful. But here are some ways in which you can treat yourself. Me personally, I always get something that I've always wanted to get for myself. Treat yourself to a nice dinner. Go out with some friends, have some drink. You can always take a vacation, which I've I've yet to do. I don't know why. Yes, I do know why because I ain't go spend that all that money one time. And finally, this video is kind of short, but it's okay. It's okay. You get the gist, right? We get the gist that stay motivated and we get the gist that we need to all stay motivated. No matter what's going on in our lives and our personal lives, you must always remember why you start your business. What was your mindset at the time when you said, oh, let me go start a business. Was it because you wanted money? Was it because you're tired of your 9 to 5 and you just want left? Was it because you just want to become your own boss? Think about those stuff when you feel, when you lack motivation. 
the most important thing is never to give up never give up bro. never give up no matter how you feel yes you can stop for a week a month a year and come back again with a new formula but never ever give up mm -hmm. stop this video and how to stay motivated while being an entrepreneur yes being an entrepreneur is sometimes stressing and shows like it gives me a lot of anxiety sleepless nights it casting it's all those stuff but at the end of the day it is rewarding and it is all worth it yeah? okay so this about sums up this video please remember to like this video please share please subscribe and please tell a friend to tell a friend that my domain is back which is period so please remember to follow me on my business page at maya underscore essential i sell all sale and retail mink clashes at an affordable price top tier quality mink clashes that will have customers coming back to you and that will have you making money honey please remember to subscribe like and share and follow me on tiktok i am on tiktok my business is on tiktok so it's maya no or is it no it's my essential and tiktok, and TikTok as well TikTok is so much fun. Check me out in my next video. Yeah, I'll be talking about other business stuff that might grab your interest and that you might like. So yeah, bye.